What's going on guys? Beastly Gamer here and today we finally got to play the Modern Warfare 2v2 Alpha. Well, at least PlayStation 4 players. I got down with my wife on this game and I had a blast. We won some and we lost some. But one thing we now know, this is a premium Call of Duty experience if we've ever seen one. The available mode is called Gunfight. It's a 2v2 mode that most first person fans have already seen. This Call of Duty sports a brand new graphics engine and the work put into it is really something to see in person. The leather, the cloth, the fabric and shadows look as real as I've ever seen them in any video game. The animations the players go through look extremely lifelike and made us break into groans because it's exactly what would happen to a human being if he were to experience these scenarios. It was kind of visceral. The guns look real. I mean, more real than anything we've seen in any Call of Duty to date. Uh, they all handle differently. And the real genius of this 2v2 gunfight mode is that Infinity Ward is forcing us to play the game with guns we'd maybe never used before. Um, only to learn that they, they are awesome and have pros and cons that we'd have never considered just going into a regular team deathmatch. There are three or four maps and they all look amazing. This whole engine is amazing with realistic shadows and lifelike colors which make enemies slightly harder to pick out in some areas. The maps in Gunfight are tight and claustrophobic and stress teamwork and communication. You gotta play it with somebody who you can talk to and explain what you see. The design makes sense and without players sliding 10 feet strafing through the air or slamming spikes into the ground, these maps make sense. The 6v6 multiplayer maps will be larger and the 20v20 maps will be massive. So there's gonna be different maps for different modes. This is a true return to form for the Call of Duty franchise. No longer are we getting the same game reskinned. This is visceral and violent. The characters move in a lifelike manner and the guns do what they're supposed to do and what they would do in real life. I truly believe that this game could revive the Call of Duty franchise. I really do. Are you playing the open alpha? If not, why not? If you're getting into it, please let me know what you think of it so far. What are the pros and cons of the Modern Warfare Alpha? Well, that's enough for me. If you like my impressions, please leave a like, comment below, and subscribe for even more future content. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time.